couple guys that I played quarterback at the time, and there were two guys that I was like, man, if I could be like those guys. And uh, so it's pretty neat now as a Hall of Famer, you sit in a hotel, you sit in a room, and Roger Starkwart walked by, and Danny White's on our staff at Arizona State, because that's where he played, and I'm like, oh my goodness, you know, I mean, and then you see other, so then, you know, I come to offensive linemen, and, and, and I studied Anthony Munoz and Mike Webster, my brother's no longer with us, but Anthony Munoz, I see him on a regular basis, and he was my offensive line hero, and I, I studied him, I tried to play like him, and now I get to be his teammate for life, and that's really cool, to sit in the hotel lobby, and just sit there, Mel Blunt walks by, and then Jackie, I met Jack Youngblood, you don't even know who that is, but when I was an older guy, I met Jack Youngblood, I took a picture with Don Major and Joe Namath, you know, I just... For those who love football, it's crazy. Kids wake up on Saturday mornings to watch cartoons. I woke up on Sunday mornings so I can watch two hours of NFL highlight movies. And, and I'm walking with those guys. And I get to be next to them. I get to be one of those guys. And now I'm going to be that guy 10 years from now that some kids will come into my hotel room or into my hotel lobby. But, dude, that's Kevin Mawai. And that's how I feel right now. I'm 40 years old. I still feel that way. And um, but I get to be one of those guys that some kids will sit there one day. And it's like I used to watch that guy play, and I wanted to just like 